Hi tech enthusiasts, welcome back to Fast Cabling, where we make tech simple. Today, we are diving into the world of wireless access points, or WAPs, and how they can supercharge your Wi-Fi coverage. Now, whether you're struggling with dead zones at home, managing a bustling office, or setting up a Wi-Fi in a public space, this video is for you. And if you have any questions about boosting your Wi-Fi coverage, setting up a smart home, or anything tech-related, we're here to help. We're offering free tech consultation for all of our viewers. So just drop your questions through the link down in the description box below, and our team of experts will provide you with the solution that tailored for your specific needs. So in today's digital age, Wi-Fi is as essential as electricity and running water. It powers our work, entertainment, and communications. From streaming movies and gaming to video conferencing and smart home devices, a strong and reliable Wi-Fi connection is crucial. But what happens when your Wi-Fi signal just doesn't reach every corner of your space? And that's where the wireless access points come in. Now, so what exactly is a WAP? In simple terms, a WAP is a device that extends the range and coverage of your Wi-Fi network. Unlike routers that handle both network traffic and Wi-Fi broadcasting, WAPs are dedicated solely on broadcasting Wi-Fi signal. So now let's think of your router as the brain of your network, managing data flow and connecting devices. And a wireless access point, on the other hand, acts as a megaphone and providing the Wi-Fi signal to cover a larger area. And this is particularly useful in large homes, offices, or public space, where a single router cannot cover the entire space effectively. But how does the wireless access point work? Now, the wireless access point works by connecting to your existing network, usually via an Ethernet cable, and then they can broadcast the Wi-Fi signal to areas that your router cannot reach. And this extends the coverage, ensuring that every device from your smartphone to your smart fridge gets a strong and stable connection. So now let's talk about the different types of wireless access points available in the market. Broadly, we have consumer-grade and enterprise-grade wireless access points, as well as indoor and outdoor WAPs. Consumer-grade wireless access points are perfect for homes and small offices, and they're affordable, easy to set up, and provide decent coverage for typical household needs. On the other hand, Enterprise-grade wireless access points are designed for larger businesses and institutions. They offer advanced features like better security, higher capacity, and more robust performance. Then we have indoor and outdoor WAPs. Now, outdoor WAPs are built to withstand harsh weather conditions and provide Wi-Fi in outdoor spaces like parks, stadiums, and campuses. And indoor WAPs, as the name suggests, are meant for indoor use, offering a range of features that tailor to indoor environments. Now let's look at some real-world applications of wireless access points. Now in business environment, WAP scaling up connectivity for office and enterprise ensure that every employee has access to fast and reliable Wi-Fi, which is crucial for productivity and collaboration. And in residential setup, WAPs enhancing home Wi-Fi for streaming, gaming, and smart devices. It eliminates those pesky dead zones in larger homes and ensuring seamless streaming and smart home functionality in every room. Public spaces like parks, cafes, stadium, and shopping malls use WAPs to provide free or paid Wi-Fi access, enhancing visitors' experience and even boosting business by attracting more customers. Lastly, let's talk about boosting innovation with WAPs. Now, first up, the mesh Wi-Fi system. 
This system uses multiple wireless access points to create a single and seamless Wi-Fi network that covers your entire home or office. No more dead zones, just smooth and uninterrupted connectivity as you move from room to room. And next, we can extend the coverage by using PoE extenders or fiber optic cables. PoE, that's power over Ethernet, allows you to extend your Wi-Fi coverage by powering your wireless access point through Ethernet cables, eliminating the need for separate power sources. And this is particularly useful in large buildings where running power lines can be challenging. And if you're interested on how to set it up, you can watch our other video. And fiber optic cables, on the other hand, offer unparalleled speed and reliability over long distances, up to a few kilometers. And by connecting your WAPs with fiber optic cables, you can ensure high-speed internet access, even in the furthest corners of your property. So there you have it, folks a comprehensive guide to wireless access points and how they can boost your Wi-Fi coverage. Now, whether you're looking to enhance your home network, manage an office setup, or provide Wi-Fi in a public space, wireless access point is the way to go. And if you found this video helpful, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. You can share it with your friends and family. And also subscribe to Fast Cabling for more tech tips and tricks. You can hit the bell icon to stay updated on our latest video. Now, thank you very much for joining us and I'll see you in the next video.